We've done a fantastic job across so many organizations of preserving genetic diversity, which will be important in future outplanting efforts. And they're actually using genets or clone lines of coral that we know are resistant to heat stress. So these individuals have been propagated from others that survived the heat stress event in 2023, whether actually out on the reef or in the ocean-based nurseries. So we have a lot of confidence that the corals that are being returned to the reef today will continue to do well even in future warming conditions. Florida's coral reef provides billions of dollars in revenue annually. And if we want generations in the future to be able to enjoy these same benefits, we have to continue to do this work and preserve this very important resource.